Hello, welcome to Video Game Bucket List. What is Video Game Bucket List? Well, essentially it's going to be my to-do list. Everything to do with video games. Could be things like buying a specific game, you know, owning that specific product. Could be completing a game or series. Or it could be something more magical like... Well, I don't want to reveal one of the things because one of the things I've already thought of and you'll find out in this episode. So, yeah. The first thing, the very first thing, numero uno on the list, is going to be the thing that actually inspired me to make the video game bucket list, and that is Chrono Trigger. I own it on DS. There's some games there. And I played it once for like 30 minutes, and I, I didn't get bored. I just stopped playing it. And this is my problem, and this is why I have to do a video game bucket list, is because I just... Stop doing things. I need motivation. And I've heard it's amazing, so number one, complete Chrono Trigger. Or Chrono Trigger. It'd be really embarrassing if I mispronounced the first ever item. <laughs> the first thing is I've got to actually find it. I recently re-kind of jigged and sorted my DS games. So I need to find where it actually is. Now, what I did was I put worse games towards the bottom and better games towards the top. I've got this kind of bad feeling that there is a chance I might have sold it. This is starting to get worrying. I'm generally starting to think I might have sold it. Oh no, hang on. No, I'm an idiot. I put worse at the top. I'm looking at all brats and stuff. Definitely didn't sell it. Surely I did not sell it. I would not have sold it, surely. I've definitely sold it. I've definitely sold it. Great start. <laughs> So let's change that to buy and complete Chrono Trigger. Next up is a joint item. It's a two-parter, but it's, it, it will help future bucket list items. Buy a PlayStation 2, brackets, preferably pink, because, I mean, just look at this. That is really, really good looking. And purchase SSX Tricky 2, which is not a game, doesn't exist and purchase SSX Tricky and play it to death. Next up, it's to do with this thing, although it's not actually this specific game, rather the original Donkey Kong Country trilogy on the SNES. Complete every bonus level, every bonus barrel, 100% plus slash complete every single Donkey Kong Country game from the original trilogy, i.e. three of them. Now this one's going to be really difficult. I actually adore the Donkey Kong Country series, but I've never actually fully completed all of them. I think they each go up to about either 101 or 103 percent, somewhere in that range, getting like every coin, every bonus. So yeah, it's going to be a tricky one. Should be good though. Next up is a super sick, awesome, amazing, epic idea. I want to customise a console. Now, it'd probably be like a SNES, I'm thinking, possibly a NES, maybe as far as like a PlayStation era, PS1 maybe, but I'm thinking SNES would probably be the coolest thing. I want to customise it, I want to do different colours, I want to add lights. So when I was thinking of this bucket list idea, I was like, colours, lights, hang on, let's do something super slick, yo, some. Let's make an Iron Man console. <laughs> I'm talking red, gold, this one's actually yellow but uh, didn't have a gold one to hand. I'm not being funny, how sick is that going to be, an Iron Man console? <laughs> now the last item for this episode, aka bringing me up to a total of five bucket list items, is a game series that I don't actually have any kind of visual aids for, so should I just pop him on screen there? Yeah, complete the original Crash Bandicoot trilogy. I find it to be a relatively difficult game, because I actually have played it quite recently. I believe I own them all on the PlayStation account system thing, because I think they're on Plus, right? So I think that means I'll be able to play it on Vita or PS4 slash PS3, probably one of them. But yeah, I'll definitely do that, and that'll be really good, I think. Yeah? So there you have it guys, this was the very first ever edition of Video Game Bucket List. I hope you enjoyed it. If you've got any suggestions for my bucket list, you know, I want it to be fairly big, so if you want to let me know in the comment section, you know, crazy ideas are welcome, I would 
definitely check them out and I definitely will expand it. So, in future episodes we will be adding more stuff to the list and checking progress of what I've been doing so far and it will be sick and awesome. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for future episodes.